good morning everybody i'm back here on the channel i've been uh took a few weeks off got quarantined had three tournaments and three weekends so it's just been a crazy time but i'm out here at trail of tears park hopkinsville kentucky and i'm going to play the front five if i got more time i may play the front nine no we'll just call it the front five that way there's no bias or unbiased opinion or whatever but today we are going to do a special challenge called Luke Humphreys versus Kale LaVisca. And how are we going to do that? Right here. I got my Luke Humphreys A4, my Kale LaVisca M4. So, holds one through five. I'm going to throw both discs for every shot, even the putt, drive, approach scramble whatever and let's see who wins okay so as i mentioned i got a 500 a4 signature series luke humphreys and a 400g m4 kale lavisca signature series so signature series battle luke humphreys kale lavisca let's see who takes it down uh hole one 275 feet go through that tunnel and then just a left a little bit I picked the front five because uh, most of my videos are on the back and I'm sure everybody's getting tired of those, seeing that and I'm getting tired of those holes. The problem with the front is hole two, four, and five with an M4 and an A4 is going to be a little tricky to get par for me. Uh, so the score may not be great, but this is just about who can win. A4 first. Oh. So I pulled that pretty bad. M4. So one early release of one turnover. So well, the basket, I don't know if you can see me. The basket's way over there. I turned this over pretty bad. People who know this course and know where I'm at. But, uh, I don't really have any line. So I'm just gonna roll it out. I may have just found a new forehand get out of trouble roller disc. It goes out way around all these trees and then back up in the woods again. It says 425 feet, par 3. Uh, the locals on U-Disc, we've changed it to par 4, mainly because we're all amateurs. But I still think it's more than 425. I think 425 may be straight this way, which you can't go that way. There's walking path, woods, everything. But uh, anyway, Kale has the box. Early releasing that M4. I think I'm trying to throw it too hard. Luke. Kale is now 
two over. Took a three on that hole with an A4. I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. I usually go driver and putter mid and I only get the three about half the time. So A4-3 on hole four. Uh, one over, two over. So Luke has taken the lead. Hole three, 365 feet. I play this one for a three. I highs around this tree. Get in the opening, up shot, hope I hit my putt. I'm predicting a three for both of these on this hole. All right, so bogey both of those holes. Uh, this is definitely some horrendous golf that I'm showing you guys, but we're gonna have fun with it. Uh, Luke still has a one stroke lead after both of them got a four. So now, hole four. Hole four, 520 feet. Absolutely no reason for me anyway to ever throw Luke or Kale off this tee, but uh, Straight across this field, it's usually a bomber drive up into the gap on the top of the hill there. I think a four for either one of these will be a success. So wet out here this morning. Alright, we stayed in bounds. Shake that one. Put it right in the gap, that's what I was trying to do. All right, we are all tied up going into the last hole. Hole five is last. I call it the am killer. Amateurs like me, kind of a mid-level amateur, it is a hard hole. Right, wrong. The basket's over there. Pretty much a horseshoe. Tight gap just to get out. It's, uh, Pretty good little distance to get around the corner where you can see the basket. That's just my goal. Straight down the middle. Highs are a little left. Just so I can get a good shot in at the basket. Hope for a three. We're tied up. Luke and Kale are tied. It's down to this. Hole five. The amateur killer at tie. This is like the equivalent of hole 17 at USDGC where anything can happen with somebody with my skill level, which is like mid-level am at best. Had to drive the disc off, it's so wet. Uh, Kel, how's the box? I have nothing to say about that. All 
right, they're equally crappy. All right, so Luke's about 10 foot away. Should be easy tap in. A little bit of work for Kale to, put, to push. The winner of the Kale, Kale LaVisca Luke Humphreys battle. Luke, A4. Uh, I like both of these discs a lot. They're both in my bag. They're both pretty new, so I haven't beat them in, so they go a little bit more stable than what they will eventually, but it was a fun challenge. As always, I like getting out here and just throwing around and having fun. I'm sure I'm going to get roasted because a lot of them shots are trash, but check out prodigydisc.com. Pick up your signature series if they don't have them. Prodigy Disc Golf Collectors on Facebook. I seen somebody post uh, yesterday, as a matter of fact, uh, that he still had a bunch and was selling them. Great price. Get out, support these guys. Um, like, subscribe, watch more of my videos. And until then, get out and have fun throwing your discs.